Um, good morning, good day, uh, good afternoon, good evening, bassists uh, around the world from wherever you are. Hi, uh, my name is Usama Allati, Palestinian bassist uh, from the city of Beit Sahur. I'm coming to you today live from RJ Music Productions. I'm here today to show my uh, bass, my Oasis custom handmade Nine Stings bass, built especially upon my specifications for me by Mauricio Costa, Brazilian luthier, currently residing in New Hampshire in USA, building these beautiful basses. Um, obviously, it's a Nine Stings bass, as I said, and I'm very happy to say it's the one and only bass in the Middle East uh, from this caliber. And I'm very happy to be the owner, the first owner of it. Um, I've been endorsing MG Bass since uh, this past February 2017, obviously this year. I'm very happy with it, very happy with the family uh, of MG Bass. Get to meet a lot of beautiful people. And uh, let's get to the most important part, the features of that bass. Well, um, the body, the top wood is uh, made out of Brazilian Embuea wood. Um, it's got three beautiful layers of mahogany. The uh, neck has also three types of wood in it, a lot of woodwork in this space. It's got uh, wenji, maple, and mahogany. It's uh, a neck through construction with total fret axis, so you can play up on the higher register easily, fast, no problems, nothing stands in your way here. Um, it's got Goto tuning machines. My uh, name, obviously, uh, is put on the uh, Plus roads cover. Um, it's got a brass nut. Let's talk about the bridge. It's a monorail bridge. I like it. Easy to deal with. It's got um, two pairs of active, uh, custom active EMG uh, pickups, uh, which is in a J configuration, single. Um, the preamp is active. It's got a volume uh, pickup selector, uh, a bass, and triple. The uh, back. Oh, the base is also nicely done. It's got good uh, combination, beautiful combination of wood. I like it. Um, it's got a total fret axis. Uh, it makes it easy to play up on the higher register. Nothing digs into the back of your hand. So uh, it's a total fret axis base. I like it a lot. Um, it's good to know that this base is uh, suitable for almost all kinds of music. Probably because it's an extended range bass, um, it's a challenge. It's got locking uh, or strap locks. Uh, as you can see, the back of the bass is also done beautifully. A lot of uh, wood combination in it. It's not, it's not heavy, by the way. It's very lightweight, uh, and I'm enjoying it. The neck is very easy to play, very easy to, to, to go on uh, from one position to another. Just have to get used to it. Um, that gets us to the uh, most important part of this video, after the specifications were addressed. How does that bass sound? So, let's take a listen.
Right, so hopefully you guys enjoyed it, uh, exploring some of the possibilities of this base, uh, which I enjoyed. Hopefully you guys also did. Um, I'd like to recommend MG Base for each bassist out there in the world. Just go try them. Contact Mauricio, he's an amazing guy, easy to deal with. And he builds amazing basses. So hopefully you get the chance to try his basses. I'd like to thank RG Music Productions for uh, the love and support, especially my friend John Handal. Also thanking uh, my friend Tamer Samir for helping me shooting this video. Hope you guys enjoyed it and see you next time.